Welcome back to part two of how to negotiate compensation like a white dude. Never ever disclose what your current base salary is. All employers ask you this question and it is bait, do not bite. The company of course wants to know if you're within budget, but more importantly, they are gauging your competency. So if you tell them that you are making well below market value of this new role, they're going to immediately think you're not competent enough to do the job because you weren't competent enough to know your value in the market. Now, some of you may be asking, how the hell do I find the value in the market? Well, here's some places you shouldn't go. Do not go to Glassdoor. Do not go to Indeed. Do not go to any site where it's employee reported data. Here's why it's skewed and it does not represent inflation. And we all know that's an all time high to truly know where you're at in the market. You have a couple different resources you can use. One is you can go to a professional an executive headhunter, an executive career coach, someone that knows these numbers because they have access to the databases that all of these employers are reporting their compensation on so it is accurate. If you don't have the funds to work with someone of that caliber yet, that's okay. The next thing you can do is every time that you are hit up on LinkedIn for a recruiter wanting to speak to you about a role, no matter what the role is, Take the time to talk to them. It's incredible interview practice, but you will start understanding where you are priced in the market because you'll see where other jobs are priced in the market. And then lastly, you need to reach out to people like you. So people that are directors of XYZ in ABC industry and get them to tell you how much money they're making. This is, believe it or not, most people will answer you, especially when you tell them why you're trying to get this information. And that way you have the data that you need when asked the question, how much is your current base salary? You're not going to respond with what you currently make. You're going to respond with, I am happy to accept a fair offer that is between this number and this number. The lower number is your floor. That means the very least you will accept that number needs to be at the 75th percentile of the market of your total compensation package, not just base salary. You can always negotiate much more than that. That way, when you do negotiate and you have to somewhat meet them in the middle, you're still coming in close to the top of the market. Stay tuned for the next video for more great tips on how you can negotiate like a white dude too.